As part of efforts to strengthen food security in Nigeria, the federal government has taken further steps to improve farmers' lot with the signing of a memorandum of understanding between the Nigerian Agricultural Mechanization and Equipment Leasing Company, NAMEL, Tractor Owners and Operators Association of Nigeria, TOAN, and Tractor Owners of Hiring Facilities Association of Nigeria, TOFAN, under the private sector-driven mechanization program in Abuja. The key objectives of the joint MOU is to effectively make mechanized services available, accessible and affordable to Nigerian farmers through a public-private partnership to increase yields per hectare and move closer to attaining national food security. Speaking at the ceremony, Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development Chief Aldo Obe decried the high interest rate on loans for farmers in the country, which he described as not conducive for agricultural production in the country. He maintained that the current high interest rate for Nigerian farmers does not encourage agricultural production in the country. He gave an assurance that the reforms that are currently ongoing in the Bank of Agriculture would soon be completed, thereby making Nigerian farmers enjoy low interest rates on loans and become shareholders in the bank. We intended to bring in farmers to become shareholders. <laughs> and please, to, hand, to fund all of you, even as individuals, buy shares. We want to have a farmer's bank. <laughs> the CBN announced that the Committee of Bankers agreed now to use what they call their credit ratio reserve, the CC or, CC or CRR to bring interest rates on agriculture and manufacturing to 9%. The minister who noted that government has no capacity to manage tractors commended the Nigerian Agricultural Mechanization and Equipment Leasing Company NAMEL and private sector mechanization service providers and Tractor Owners and Hiring Facilities Association of Nigeria, TOFAN, for their support and expressed the federal government's commitment to give the service providers necessary support to grow and provide quality services for farmers. The minister described the project as a good innovation which the country hoped for and should never be allowed to die, noting that using agriculture to bring life into the rural areas is one of the policy thrusts of the President Mohamed Buhari-led administration. In his remarks, the chief executive of Nigerian Agricultural Mechanization and Equipment Leasing Company, NAMEL, Dr. Hamed Adekunle, said the partnership between NAMEL and the mechanization service providers, MSP, would not only provide equipment to Nigerian farmers, but also build local capacity to operate, maintain, and maximize their users. He promised that the partners would remain committed and change the narrative of mechanization in the country. Mechanization has become uh, a problem in Africa. Why? Because it's capital intensive and needs some special areas on application to increase productivity. He stressed the need to further strengthen agriculture in Nigeria through mechanization. He announced that NAMEL, in collaboration with heavy duty equipment giant Mantrak, would soon launch a nationwide integrated agricultural land development scheme to open more lands on a flexible payment term. 